Due to the growing popularity of cryptocurrency and NFTs, the YouTube platform has seen a massive surge in channels related to the crypto world and there are a lot of new opening channels as we're speaking of it. But the thing is, not all of the channels are with the same noble intention of educating the world about this crypto space. Some of them have the sole purpose of deceiving people and filling their own pockets by mostly shilling coins. Now, one of the most popular crypto channels is Coin Bureau with over 2 million subscribers. Some interesting facts about the channel or more specifically, Guy, the presenter of the Coin Bureau, have come to light. Let's dive deeper into them. In one video of the Coin Bureau, Guy made a video about 10 crypto price predictions for 2021 and surprisingly, all of the coins hit the amounts mentioned in the video. The video was also quite well received by the crypto enthusiasts of YouTube. But a controversy related to Guy and Coin Bureau started to come out as one Reddit post called the channel out. According to the Reddit post, Guy is a paid actor and he isn't a founding partner of Coin Bureau. Guy joined the team of the channel a bit later after it was founded. The original founder of Coin Bureau is Nick Perkrin, who worked for the famous investment bank Goldman Sachs. Managing a crypto channel isn't an easy task, so the more help you can get, the better content you can deliver. So that is why there is absolutely nothing wrong with Coin Bureau choosing Guy as the face of the channel unless they use Guy's fans to shill scams. Well, the guy did respond to the Reddit post and if you want to learn more about him, pay a visit to Coin Bureau's website and Guy's Reddit. Then the post continues a bit more into Coin Bureau, saying the name V3 Digital, the company behind these channels. V3 Digital is a marketing agency that helps channels to generate revenue from several affiliate programs as well as other services. Now, this can raise some concern that Coin Bureau can affiliate many scams to its viewers. Well, the Reddit post surely said that the agency is available to the highest bidder to shill whatever coins or project they like, but if you follow Coin Bureau, you won't see any kind of shilling of scams to the viewers. All of the reviews are quite legit. It becomes much clearer if you go to the Coin Bureau website. The offers they have on the page are mostly related to their own merch. They surely have some affiliates that give you deals on useful crypto services like digital wallets and stuff nothing feels out of the place. The channel's face guy has been pretty open on Reddit about the funding of the channel and if you hear his words, you can easily say that's the way you should be earning money from YouTube and the content they make on their channel is surely pretty good which is why they're getting a lot of attention and that is completely fair. As for the claim that Guy is only a paid actor and doesn't know anything about the crypto exchange world, think of it like this. A man who has been presenting crypto exchanging facts for like 5 years now, did you think he has taken up a lot, I mean a lot of knowledge? He may even have an above average crypto knowledge because 5 years is a pretty big number. There are a lot of YouTube channels that are running scams and Coin Bureau is not among one of them. Want to know the biggest crypto scam YouTube channels? Let us know in the comments and we will create one for you.